Oh, he's almost getting me. He's picking his boys up. Nice. Woo. I'm a professional Warzone coach for Gamer Sensei, and I basically teach people how to get better at playing Warzone. My background is originally as a player, um, playing Call of Duty way back as the game started getting more competitive and esports became a thing. Started participating in tournaments uh, in Call of Duty 4. We also had a professional Call of Duty team participating in World League, and I was helping to manage that team. Last night, I recorded my 61st Warzone victory, which when you think about how many games I've played, it's not a lot. Well, I can tell you exactly how many wins I have, and I think it's under 20. I'm really worried that a pro is going to say, you're way off, bud. Everything you do is wrong. You're using the wrong guns. You're bad at this game. <laughs> But as someone who's actually been coached by a gamer, I truly do believe that it'll give you an edge. Hi, Rich. Thank you so much for uh, coming in here and teaching Iffy some skills. Yeah, you know, definitely, definitely that's what's about to happen. But no, I'm glad to be here. I'm super excited. Uh, I think uh, I think it's going to be uh, real spicy. Hey, guys. Yes, we'll see who's dragging who along out of you two. But yeah, hopefully <laughs> we're just going to have some good games. <laughs> and yeah, after it all goes to pot, then we can play the blame game after that as a added bonus. Today I'm hopefully going to get you guys to play a little bit more on the aggressive side. The best way to get better at this game in general is by fighting, but regardless of playstyle, I think it's always good to go through phases of really sort of putting yourself in the deep end and just bashing out fights. This is a kind of awkward opening circle, but we're going to get stuck into the middle of it, so we're going to land here. We're gonna pick up a bounty, we're gonna get ourselves some guns, and then we're gonna push. Three for down. That's my friend Iffy. It was mostly Rich, I just killed after you. Oh, down. I could only I could only see. <laughs> okay, so they're fighting now, which means it's probably a pretty good time to get involved because we're gonna be third partying, right? So we have a lot of advantages here. Let's try and stay relatively close together. Yeah, can we well, are we pushing in? I see. Him. Okay. There it is. Okay, nice. So we've got a team on the fire station. Now this is potentially a bit of an awkward push. What we're probably going to want to do is go to this shop first so we can get a UAV to play this fight and maybe even a precision airstrike. Okay, so I'm going to buy a UAV and now what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to hold that UAV until it goes orange on Maddie. It's red. Wait, I got somebody. I think I got somebody here. Why is it red? Oh, yep, tower. Fire station tower. Okay, it's gone right. orange, so maybe he's looking to disengage. Muni bar. Nope, still in the tower. Found him okay, in the tower. Nice. Maybe use your position, use your position on the uh, you tower. Got it. Sending Just... in. I want your ass, bud. Nice, there you go. Perfect. We should push together on the tower then. Let's push together. Oh. Ping. Green ping. Wow. Okay, he's close, holding the wall. Oh, come on. Oh. oh, he got me. Oh, yeah. There it is. Woo, too early to end now. Too early to end now. I think maybe we should consider landing on this building here. Okay. And just kind of get like a mini reset going where we just get guns and stuff and then maybe look to move towards our loadout eventually. I think I heard someone on metal. Be careful. Oh, 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 no cross. You ran. Oh, yeah. Look at this cornball. Ah, we should probably try and disengage this. Yeah, I was trying to get out of there, but they got me. Is there multiple that you can see? Yeah. Yeah. Ah. Two minimum. Yeah, I'm toast. No vehicle. That is really unfortunate. Ooh. Oh, ah, nice, try. nice try. We had a really good aggressive push early, took a nice clean fight, then went to go and take the next bounty fight, and unfortunately we got hunted at the same time as we were hunting another team, so we found ourselves in a bit of a sandwich situation. So I think that game illustrated perfectly kind of how sandwiching works in this game which is why it's important sort of in every aspect of the game that you're always like clearing and making space in a single direction so you can always play in one direction 
gonna try and play a bit more to your guys comfort zone now and maybe play a, a bit slower we're not gonna be you know hiding or camping or anything like that but also just trying to maybe play you know a bit smarter and putting ourselves in positions where we're only really taking it fights where we have a big advantage let's try and stick a little bit together yeah i'm right here let's push the white building got him he's here okay let's push white to make sure it's safe Oh, oh crawling. Shh, nah, I can't. Pushing them hard. Nice. Oh, guy just picked up a most wanted in this house. Nice. Good stuff. Okay, it's so yellow again. So that means they're probably lumber side. Yeah, lumber. On my live ping. Oh, right. Uh, they are 198, 200. I got them all heartbeat. Oh, on the rock, on the rock. Right above you. Ah. So we'll kind of play edge for now, just in case Maddie gets that yeah. opportunity to get stuff back. We'll just see what the circle does. We still have the option of like doing an aggressive rotate. Maybe we can go all the way around here mm -hmm. and steal this vehicle. I'm dead. Okay, yeah, let's let's make a big boy play here. Oh, on the ground here. Yeah. 338. I think we can to your media left, of sight them. Oh, I'd shoot you myself. Hello, friends. Oh, well, I'm lucky that they decided to dodge that fight because uh, that could have gone very badly. Yeah, they're trying to get at me. Oh, let's play this game then. I don't want to get. They're all inside. Yeah, they're all inside yeah. this building. I'm just trying to get a little bit more in the circle. Than you. I killed one and I'm out of there. Oh, in front of me. Oh, right here. There you go, there's some armor. This tree. I'm down. Got one. One here on me. Okay. He's cracked as well. It's 1v1v1, one one one, Iffy. Okay. Take the one on your left, take the one on your left. Yep, we'll play this spot. In front of you, in front of you. Yep. Oh! Ah, unlucky. Shoot, 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 shoot. Oh, oh unlucky. Yeah. Well? Oh. That was it, too. That was it. We yeah. are third place. Third place. 1v1v1. I think it's very clear that you guys are much more comfortable playing circle and that your level of understanding of playing circle is actually pretty decent. Like you said, Rich, we had the circle. We knew what we were doing with the circle. If we could shoot good. Yeah, so obviously we got super deep in that game, didn't quite pay off, but I just want this last game to basically be like an amalgam of the two things, right? Like we've talked about how to play aggressively. We've also seen you guys in your comfort zone and getting super deep into the game. So let's try and combine the two in this last game and see if we can pull it out. This game might be a little bit crazy because uh, it's a shallow drop and there's a million bounties in this area, but uh, yeah, we're gonna go ahead and do this one. And as I said, we're going for the most Southern one, because this behind is all dead space, right? So it's gonna allow us to play just in one direction. And you want, oh, that's, okay, the game is glitching a little bit. Mm, he's already setting the stage for the excuse <laughs> train to roll through. There's also a plate for one of you here. Oh, I already have a plate, so go ahead and take that many. Try and keep up with the game tempo that me and Rich are setting. <laughs> oh, need a reload. You stop. Get him! Nice! Jesus. And then same again, because we're being hunted. I think we'll just hold off on the UAV until it goes orange. I'm gonna throw a drone up. Okay, it's orange. Probably consider using that uh, UAV. Oh, I got again. him. On the roof. Alright, pop that UAV. Downed one. One's dead. Is there another? Oh, nope. Not on the roof. Right there. Oops. Nice. Nice. Okay, one dot on his own. Uh, obviously, they could be ghosted, but uh, I like our odds here, so we're going to play aggressively and push this guy together. He's out. He's out. Nice. Nice. Maddy with the quickie. So we can actually get ahead of them and out, try and outzone them, because they're going to need to come in a little bit. I only see two, and they're running out in the open. 
He's back up. They're both back up. Oh, there's three! Oh! He's almost getting me. He's picking his boys up. Nice. Woo! My aim was so horrible. <laughs> okay, so nice little out zone. We played that a bit uh, more aggro than maybe we should have, but let's go results based analysis and say that was a sick play all around. Okay, we got a whole group of guys in front of us. In fact, that's our bounty. They just bought a loadout, so we can play this a bit more passively. Getting crap on? Oh, he hit me fast. Oh, they jumped in somehow, bro. Oh, they came here. What? Oh my goodness. Oh, I'm coming back. Me too. Not sure what to. Well, that was tight. Like, we're both back. People at this wall, multi a whole team. Yeah, a lot of people. Yeah, there. I see a whole squad. I can still know where <laughs> any weapons. Nice, nice. Oh! Where did I get sniped from? Okay, these guys nice. are dead. That nice. guy is dead. Oh, to our right. Right here. Oh, F doesn't do it. Right in front of y'all. Ah. Oh, this is the last squad. <laughs> yeah, one on your wall. A nice try. That was rough. Second place. Damn. If I had ammo, we would have had that. I think they did pretty good. I mean, obviously, for the most part, I was kind of deliberately putting them outside of their comfort zone. Right now, I would class them as, like, smarter players rather than, you know, necessarily, like, super comfortable in certain gunfights. But, yeah, no, I thought it was good, and I thought they did well. I already feel more comfortable, and I'm ready to just keep at it and apply the things that you taught me. Thank you, Rich. Very much. I can't wait to be a clapper, and then you'll be inviting me to your games. Hey, everybody. Thanks for watching, and if you like this video, then make sure you subscribe. And you know what? Check the playlist out. There's plenty more. Go on. Have fun. Keep watching. I'll just be here.